mean, I think for young dancers, um, we really have to always remember, even if we're educating them in dance, we're educating the person. And I think in dance, dancers start very young. And we all go through phases of puberty, growing, family situations can change, homesickness. Um, I think the more that the team can dialogue, work together and create an atmosphere that is supportive, um, there's always going to be hard moments, exciting moments, but I think the more that we're aware and we allow people especially the dancers to say, I have pain, I'm injured, I need time. I think the more we are aware of their mental well-being, their physical well-being, are they eating well, are they sleeping well? And I think also we have to respect that interests change. You know, if you start dance at 10 years old and your focus is, you know, to complete and really, you know, an education, there's many different styles of dance. Your interests can change. So I think the more we can um, work to understanding each other, supporting, um, then I think we all are stronger in the end. I mean, dance you need. Yes, you need dedication, it, you need hard work, but it can also be so inspiring and beautiful. And for a young dancer, the Prix de Lausanne, it's not about competing against the other dancers, it's about your own expectations. Did I improve? Did I grow? Did I learn? I've made new friends. I've made a new, discovered a new style. So I think the more we can be transparent and, and um, supportive, I think we can actually go farther.